Assalamualaikum guys. Today we're going to learn about using the text tool in Paint. The text tool is used for inserting text in a picture. The text tool appears in the home tab. In the home tab. Formatting applies the chosen appearance to text. Formatting. Color 1 is used to change the text color, meaning I'll sh color Later, we'll do the experiment. First of all, we'll read. Color 2 is used to change the background color of the text box. Four, four error heads are used to drag the text box to a new location in the drawing area. Double-headed error is used to change the width and the length of the test text box. Opaque means the color given as background will hide everything beneath it. Transparent means the color given as background will display everything beneath it, making it transparent. Clipboard is a temporary folder where the selected part of the picture is stored. The options are available in the clipboard group are cut copy and paste or I'll say CCP. Now we're going to learn about the components of the text tab. Different components of the text tab are shown below. Look, there is a found name, a found size and a bold, bold which is here and italic, underline, strike through, Background group and color split. Now, these are the formats of the text bold, italic, underline, strike through, computer, 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 computer. These are not actually formats, it's just showing how does it look like if you write something. Says of making a copy of a drawing on MS Paint. Now, now we're gonna do the practical. I hope you guys are ready. Now, now you have to complete these steps. So, let's get started. So, so we're gonna start the drawing. So now let's draw a drawing as a first step. Now I'll just draw a simple oval. Just wait. And then. Okay. Now this is also one amazing thing which I'm gonna about to do. Okay. Now I'm just gonna fill this color. And now watch. Just watch me. It's amazing. Sorry, it's not controllable with the mouse. It's really bad. Now, since we're done with the drawing, now, as the next step, it was. Now, our next step is to click at the rectangular selection option. Now, it's here. Click here. Now, it's saying select the drawing. Now, it's saying, wait, okay. Click at the copy option from the clipboard group of the home tab. Now, we just copy this. And now you can see that this is able to be pasted. Click at the paste option from the clipboard group here. One, two, three, four, five. There are five categories in the home tab. So let's paste it. Do not uh, do it like this. Just simply click on the picture and then bam! I got now you have made a copy of the original version of the original drawing. You have made a copy of the original drawing. So Allah Hafiz guys, hope you have a good day. 
like and subscribe to my channel so you cannot miss out any future future updates of my videos and yeah a lot of